曾经有一句广告词风靡全国，也风行华人圈：“人头马一开，好运自然来。”他就是今天的采访主角——人头马君度集团。这是一家差不多有三百年历史的法国家族企业，旗下拥有很多我们耳熟能详的知名的高端品牌，像路易十三、人头马。君度成就的。3月25日，人头马君度集团大中华区 CEO Nicholas Beck 接受了我们的采访，透露了该公司最新的组织架构调整和业务变化，也分享了对疫情后市场的观察。Beck 提示了两个关键点：海南自贸港的机会，以及电商渠道。以下就听听他怎么说。So to introduce、uh, China is of course for us, for our company, a strategic market for many years.、Uh, a strategic market,、uh, especially now as well,、uh, because、uh, thanks to the good control of the pandemic in、uh, in China,、uh, China is one of the only market or very few market in the world showing growth. 所以 ，definitely we are looking at it、uh, very carefully, and、uh, definitely it's something that we believe is strategic for us,、uh, and that one of the reason, and that the reason why we are going to attend for the first time to the CI, CICPE, CICPE in、uh, Hainan in、uh, in May with、uh, Remy Quintero there,、uh, because we feel Hainan is a lot of business opportunities.、Uh, then regarding the local Hainan、uh, policy. Uh, at this stage, nothing has been officially confirmed and announced、uh, by the government. So it's something we are looking at very carefully,、yeah. and、uh, we are we are getting ready、uh, for the day the local market will be also open for for duty free. Uh, so first of all, on Hainan,、um, we have、uh, we are discussing now on the offshore market. So with CDFG, with uh, with uh, Shenzhen Duty Free, CNSC, all the offshore、uh, licenses and mall,、uh, we are discussing currently with them、uh, to have more uh, boutique, uh, shopping shop uh, visibility.、Mm. Uh, so some have been confirmed,、uh, some are still under discussion.、Mm. But the idea for us is definitely to be present with our product in the top uh, top uh, offshore shopping malls. Probably we will have different products、uh, mm -hmm. in terms of uh, size. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe we are going to have more exclusive product、yeah. for customer in、uh, Hainan,、yeah. uh, because the whole idea for us is to try to differentiate as much as possible the product.、Yeah. Uh, also for the consumer when they go to Hainan to give them the good occasion to buy、uh, and maybe to bring a souvenir of their stay in Hainan、uh, when they are back to China.、Mm. Uh, so it's work in progress, but probably to have differentiate product and differentiate、uh, SKU、mm. uh, would be one of the solution. The, the COVID has been、uh, accelerating, I think globally, worldwide, has been accelerating some、uh, trends, and one of the trends is definitely e-commerce. Alors,、uh, of course, in China, e-commerce was already very big. But in the rest of the world, it was pretty small for our business.、Uh, second thing, I think、um, if we look at the Chinese consumer, I think、uh, after COVID,、uh, consumer are more looking after uh, uh, transparency. I think、uh, for in terms of purchasing, they want to know more about the brand, they want to know more about the product, and their their consumption is getting more and more into qualitative. It's not a big change due to the, the pandemic, but、uh, e-commerce, as I mentioned, to always has been a strategic、uh, channel for us. And since I'm the CEO、uh, for the last four years, the e-commerce team re report directly to me、mm. uh, because we consider that it has to be a kind of、uh, company in the company, a startup.、Mm. Uh, because the profile of the people、uh, working in these channels, they are very young.、Uh, most of them they just graduate. 
uh, they are very creative, they have a lot of ID, mm. and uh, our, our concept was to, to, to let them uh, apart mm. and uh, to give them a lot of freedom, mm. uh, a lot of freedom to develop the business. And I think so far it has been, uh, it has been quite successful. Mm. Uh, then the pandemic, what I mentioned before, uh, change is uh, Ainan, uh, typically something new for us, and that's why we have decided uh, to uh, to uh, initially was managed by the travel retail, the global travel retail team in uh, in Singapore, mm. and now we have decided that it should be managed by uh, the Chinese team.